What's up everyone? This is London the Pink back with some more Animal Crossing New Horizons. So today is kind of different. We have some kind of museum rally, which is great. I had some more bamboo shoots from Daisy May. But I don't know Daisy. Your bamboo shoots, they don't grow. I don't they're not doing anything for me. And they're not growing, I'm not seeing anything, nothing. Okay. Ah, it's a beautiful morning. Oh, and all of my... Oh, it's gonna be one of those days. Okay. Now the first things first is I want to run over to, to Nook. Well, run here. Collect what I can from the uh, Nook Miles thing. And then run on over to Nook's Cranny. Just open up my water bottle real quick. Okay. That way it's already open. Check this. What's in here? Nothing. Cool. Run over here. Let's see what they have. Yeah. Mm hmm I'm not even sure if I have any money on me. I don't remember. Oh, I do. Okay, cool. I'm sorry. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, I always say hello. Hello. <laughs> and Casper. Rock the Casper. Okay, bought that. Cool. Cool. All right. And I want to go over and check the turnip prices for my island. So I'm going to get that done because I do AM and PM. It's a good thing that I'm naturally waking up early. You know, some days I'm a little sluggish, like, eh, I could just go back to sleep. But then I remind myself, no, I wake up early because I want success. So there you go. Oh, okay, they got some interesting things going on today. I want the ball. Because I was thinking of making like a sportsy gym type area. We move, 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 move. I want the treadmill. How much is that going to cost? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay. So I can get it. I can get it as long as I sell off all of my fruits. So, yeah, I'll buy that. Ooh. Nice little saxophone. Is that a saxophone? Should be a saxophone. Saxophone. Yeah. I'll buy that. Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay. Come here. I want that treadmill. Because I think I'm going to make an outdoor gym. And <laughs> that's the only thing you can really make in this game. Outdoor everything. Um, I don't want the wheel. The ball. Oh, no. There is an exercise ball. Okay. Because I was about to say, like, I don't think I... I don't think I should keep the ball, and I, there is an exercise area. I mean, an exercise ball in this game. I'm gonna sell that. Oh yeah, and the reason why I came here, turnip prices. 58 bells. Okay, let me mark that down. 58. Not that great. <laughs> Alright. Mm-hmm. They're saying I'll have a spike in the week, but it's just saying like up to 200. So that's not really looking all that amazing for me. I'll go back to my stream. And there we go. But, you know, it is what it is. Now we got to find my fossils. And then, oh, I just see one right there. Cool. Oh, and that. <laughs> Rock the Casper. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna make an outdoor gym area. I saw the treadmill, and I think there's some other gym equipment too, but I'll have to look through it. Dun, 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 dun. That's probably not even how the song goes. That's just how I remember it in my head. I right, come up this way because I just remembered the stupid bottle. <laughs> Collect these things. Now that I don't have to worry about my turnips. And I'm also checking my discords. Because I'm part of two discord groups for Animal Crossing. And uh, they they usually list when they have a, like, a really good price. That's just like a sea bass or something. So I'm checking those as well. Alright. Over here. Get all these twigs. Now twigs do not decrease your 
town rating because they're a natural occurrence just like the seashells they don't decrease your town rating they're a natural occurrence on on your island so you're you're okay if you have those on the island but like i think the bottle does decrease because it's not natural it's, not, it's, it's um it's been made And uh, I think one of the major reasons why I started waking up dumb early. Oh, I could catch it. Nah, nah, it's already over there. And I don't have the damn pole with me, so I can't get it. But yeah, I started waking up naturally. Um, was because. We've had garbage can theft twice. Someone would just, like, the, you know, the garbage man would come. They would just kind of throw down the, our garbage cans. And some jerk would just go and steal our garbage cans. The first time, we had a big snowstorm, and the, the garbage can got, like, stuck by our fence. It's not really our fence. It's, like, the neighbor's fence. It got stuck on our side of the property in the snow near their fence. And we suspect it was their construction people who took it because there was no other persons around at the time. It was just them, they were doing construction on their, their front property or whatever. And after that, garbage can gone. So I definitely feel like they took it. <laughs> um, so that was the first time our garbage can was stolen. And then second time was more recently we had this new they're not really new like the lady who used to live in their house she apparently passed away and they're like her grandkids and a baby father and stuff so they came and took the house and they're not they're weird because when they came in they came in really loud and angry and kind of hateful and then the other day we were outside doing our property and they came out to help us <laughs> And I was just like, oh, you guys know how to be decent. That's weird. So, <laughs> so I don't really know what to make of them at this point. I said thank you and, you know, I showed them appreciation for helping, but I was very skeptical. Like, I, I don't know what this is. I don't know what to, what to make of this. Because one minute you guys are getting drunk and stealing our stuff, and then the next minute you're coming out to help us do the lawn. I, I don't get it. <laughs> but... I'm not gonna say no. <laughs> so, um, because. No, no, no! I didn't even choose that. I was trying to get rid of it. Alright, whatever. Yeah, so because they, um. Because they did that, uh. <clears throat> we bought all these security cameras. And I labeled them Catch Those Bastards. <laughs> <laughs> so, and then, you know, my neighbor, he installed two of them for us, and he showed me how to properly use the damn drill. Because <laughs> I looked up a YouTube video, but I still didn't feel too confident, and then he just showed me, and he was like, because the drill that I got, it's Black & Decker, and it's like a full set, it comes with all these parts and pieces and doohickeys, and I got it on Amazon for a pretty good deal, but we were thinking, like, it's, it's probably garbage, and he was like, no, it's actually pretty good. I was like, oh, okay, cool. So, it's a it's a pretty good one. It's it's not a big drill. It's not like, you know, if I hold it, my arm is gonna hurt or anything. It's decent. It's decent for me. So, and it's it is powerful because I thought that I just got a piece of garbage. You know, it wasn't working right for us. Oh, get it, get it, get it. Mm. Okay, got it. But it turns out it was amazing because I got the job done, and I'm happy. But yeah, so we got security cameras all over the house now, like everywhere. And the unfortunate part of that is these security cameras are extremely sensitive to everything. So if there's even a breeze, it's saying there's a motion <laughs> near the house. And I'm just like, what are you talking about? There's nothing. But my mom's friend, who is the one who recommended we get these cameras, she um, pretty much said it's a good thing, you know. We shouldn't lower the sensitivity. We shouldn't try to tweak it in any way. Just keep it as is. 
so I put the sensitivity back up and uh, you know now I'm getting a thousand notifications a day but at least I know that the property is being watched I don't understand they're just not growing is it because it's near this do I have to move it but then what's the sense like I wanted it to be like a foresty type deal I don't know I'll have to look oh, what the hell I wasn't expecting that that uh, beetle to be there they spawn back really fast is there any more no that one just seems to spawn really fast for some reason but how many uh, fossils did we get so far just two okay so there's way more and of course you know I gotta get all of these fruits I gotta catch them all oh, I gotta get them all and I could have sworn I had way more money trees than this but I gotta remember they have to grow first they're in the growing phase try and lift up the camera a little because I need to see no. Hmm. Weird. Weird, 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 weird. Um, yeah, I never did get around to moving these flowers. <laughs> ah. I told you, once I play for the stream, I don't play again for the day. But now that I have turnips, I do check. What's that? That doesn't look like a regular butterfly. Oh. I'm here bug catching and I need space for my fossils. Good grief. <clears throat> the cameras are great though. I, I'll tell you, they are called blink cameras. They capture everything. We also got the ring for the front door. And it captures everything. It's really handy. It's notifications out the ass, but it's really, it's really handy to have. Oh, there it is. This place is kind of difficult because I have my stuff here and I don't want to accidentally pick them up. Yep, I got my fossil. Cool. And there we go. Okay, we come over here. This whole place is filled with flowers. It's lovely. Okay, um... I'm gonna try and put this away and collect these. Try and get at least some of the fruits now. That way I don't have to keep making double and triple tr trips. <sighs> but yeah, they're called blink cameras. See, just as I'm talking about them above front door, it's saying there's a motion. And all the motion is, is a car went by. <laughs> so that's a, that's a bit, you know, unfortunate, but it, it's okay. You know, we need, we need the protection. Just be aware that they are battery operated, but they do connect to your Wi-Fi. So if you are a person who doesn't have reliable Wi-Fi, you might want to look into a wired camera system. I would say that the Wi-Fi where our garage is because we have a detached garage so it's it's actually a bit further away from the house and um, the Wi-Fi can be really sketchy in that region so I'm thinking we may need to get a wired connection for the Wi-Fi for the the garage um, camera but we got all of them don't we yeah we got them all okay yeah, the fruits have grown in here, but I'm not collecting. Oh, wow. It's almost all of them. That's really cute. That's really, that's wow. Okay, that, it's really interesting how that worked out. Up here is beautiful. It needs more, though. It needs way more. I want more greenery. More flowers, especially pink. <laughs> that's pretty. Okay, I like that. <sighs> oh, yeah, and I had gotten this planter box. Can I put it here? Where is it? No. Where is I going to put it? It's going to be here? Let's see. Oh, how did it get over there? Hmm? 
Hmm. Uh, okay. So that's as far as it can go. Ow. Mm. It's not bad, I guess. But it needs a bit more. It needs more. Yeah, it definitely needs way more. Alright, let me go get, get that one coconut in the middle there. And I've been thinking, like, I should probably chop, chop, the, chop that down. But, like, I wanted to have, like, a nice spa area. So when you're in the spa, you go and sit in there and you have your palm tree, you know? I want it to look nice. But this coconut does get in the way when Red visits and I can't get into his freaking boat. <laughs> this damn coconut tree is in the way. So I'm like, eh, I don't know. I don't know what to do. Don't know. Right, but I'm gonna go down here. Oh, actually, I think I have enough for the treadmill. Yeah. Let's go get that. Oh, and Kix is here again. Wasn't he here yesterday? Or the day before? I think he was here the day before. Or yesterday, I don't remember, whatever. But he is here again. Let me get this. Nice, sweet treadmill. I'll buy it. Mm-hmm. Now, they, apparently they're saying that we don't get any more upgrades for Nook's Cranny compared to New Leaf where we have like five upgrades for the shop. But I think that's just for now. You remember, they're doing everything through like internet updates. So I think as the game goes on, they're going to open up more features for the game. It's unfortunate that doing they're, that they're doing it like that, but you know, they they're trying something a little bit different with this version of Animal Crossing. So <clears throat> we just have to see what happens. Leathers, sorry you are sleeping and I'm waking you up. Oh dear, pardon me. Good morning, Simone. Okay, today in honor of International Museum Day, we're holding a stamp rally. Okay. Works thusly. The bog fish and fossil galleries each have three stamp stations. You must find the stations within each gallery and acquire the necessary stamps. You must find the stations within each gallery and the necessary stamps and a prize. You can earn three unique prizes one for completing the rally in each of the three galleries. Who? It's true. Do be sure to give it a go whilst perusing the mu museums when you find exhibits. Okay. Alright, get here. Turn those in. <coughs> oh, as usual. Alright, so first, you know I gotta do my routine things. And then I'm gonna come back and do the museum thing. <coughs> Alright, first things first. I need to turn this music in. I'm just gonna place that treadmill up there somewhere. Whoops, I didn't mean to open that. <laughs> place that treadmill somewhere and um because that's where gonna where the uh, exercise place is gonna be. Okay. Things that will go in inventory. Is this Viet these. This bamboo shoots. Is that it? Yeah. Whoops. Okay. Okay. KK Casper. Where is it? <laughs> this is so funny, I can't take it. What the heck? Oh. No. Huh. So 
this is a horror over here. Okay, that's really weird. Huh. Oh, was it KK Fusion? I don't remember what it was. I don't remember. I just gotta go. <laughs> Oh, Caspa is the one I bought today, so it must have been KK Fusion, I think. Okay. Um, you know, it's early in the morning for me. My brain ain't working. I'm going to put all these together. Try and clean this up a bit. Okay, we don't want to sell the giant clams. If I could grab it, thank you. And we have enough sand dollars potential gifts golden gears okay all right it's time to start collecting I do want to plant one of these apples these apple trees over by um, my outdoor library so let me go and do that I should be planting way more apples look at this these don't they don't have anything and they rarely ever yeah I'm gonna chop them down hold on let me I gotta get another axe because I'm gonna chop all these down do they never grow? The ones up here all produce, but those don't do anything. You see? All of these. Is that where that one is? Yeah. Okay. And the apple. Plant it. There we go. Now when it when it grows, you should be able to see it. That way we'll have all of them. Cool. Alright. Since I'm up here. What can we put up here? So these do not get picked. They're going to stay like that. And hopefully, if I do have anyone on my island, they won't be obnoxious enough to pick them. Because you can invite people and hope that they have the best of intentions, and instead they're complete scumbags. So... <coughs> And I still have to give gifts to all of my the two villagers. Okay. Like that. Turning these in. I get a good like 200,000 every time I turn it. Probably more than 200,000 because I have a lot of fruit trees. But I get a good amount. Oh, what? I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. Okay. <laughs> oh yeah. You know what? First things first. <clears throat> Before I shake all of them and then I can't remember which ones grow and which one don't. Oh. Every single time I'm busy, man. Gosh. Ah. Uh -huh. Oh, okay. Let's see. I was about to get very angry. <laughs> really? Okay. <laughs> That's not a bad find. Because I do I did want one more for my, my outdoor library. Um 
Let me put it here. Eh? Oh, maybe because I'm standing right in it. There we go. Now it's not the same color. And it'll do. It's all nice and green and pink. Nice. But yeah, so while I, what I was trying to do was run back home and get another axe because I know when I start chopping stuff down it's gonna break let's see if I can plant some apple trees yeah that seems like a good idea get rid of this get out and plant that one. But I don't know why they don't grow. Plant this one. Okay, I gotta collect the others. So let's come over here. Go, 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 go. And my other apple tree. Alright. So as long as there's a spot around the flowers, then they'll grow. That's good. Okay. So I need another axe. Probably two more. For space. Uh oh. Just made it with space. I'm not going on. Put this over here. There we go. Let me check these blasted cameras. Good grief. Every minute, yo. Ooh, there's something there. I'm like, what? What is there? Okay. Give me one moment. What is it? Nothing. As I figured. Gosh. Notifications upon notifications upon notifications. Jesus. Nice. Alright. Come over here. Plant the apple tree. You know what? I'm going to look up if you can only have a certain... <laughs> That's not what I wanted to do without. Okay. If you can only have a certain... I do want a tree here. Okay. Alright, so plant one there, one there. Yeah, this one hasn't grown. But I don't understand why. Chop it down. It has to go. I don't, I don't understand. <coughs> plant this. There's a couple back here that haven't grown either. See? Oh, fudge buckets. <laughs> Get out the way, plants! Coming through! <laughs> there we go. Perfect solution every time. Every time. You're not going to get me, I'll tell you that right now. Now, I was, I was just about to wonder <coughs> if the reason why they don't grow is due to the fact that they have wasps. But the other ones, I cut them down and there was no wasp. So, I'm just liable to believe <laughs> that <laughs> these are just some non-growing mother chuckers. <laughs> I should have some gorgeous 
gorgeous apple trees back here. Cut that down. I should really be checking them for wasp first though. Well, actually, let me check for wasp. I already made a mistake just now. Money. Money's good. Alright. There we go. Now we have an open space here. Probably put another garden right there. And this one hasn't grown either. And no, they don't grow on like another day or anything. They just don't grow. Ever. Don't produce anything. So I don't know what the issue is. I feel so empty not having anything. Alright, what do I have? Okay. I need more peach trees. Yeah, plant a peach. This feels so empty. I'm gonna see if I can kind of straighten this out a bit and uh, make it a little bit more uniform and just put a bunch of flowers all around it. I mean, the shape is okay. That's that's its own natural shape. I did not manipulate that at all because I, I don't really like manipulating too much. Oh, yeah, we don't have any space. Okay. go and put some of the stuff away. I sell some of the stuff we don't need. Okay, come up here. This is gonna be a long episode because this is a lot we have to do. We still have to do the museum thing. And I didn't even get finished with uh, collecting all of my fruits and stuff. Um, I guess we put some more in there, put them in, because as long as I have a stack of at least 10 of each fruit, then I'm alright. So I have that, take that out, take this out, okay, need more of these, and one more peach. Just in case, you know, just in case anything happens, I have my backup stash of fruit. Alright, now it's time to you see. You know what I'm saying? All these flowers. Some of them are just so disorganized. They make my heart hurt. Now, uh, was there a tree over here that didn't grow either? Yeah, this one. Never grows. Ever. And I don't know why 